understand of us, uh, artist Cipriano Martinez, who is here uh, with us, uh, and this is a um, uh, stand of the Maddox Gallery in London. Cipriano is also a Venezuelan, and he lives in London, and he comes from a strong tradition of uh, printmaking and painting. And maybe you should say a few words about both the printmaking uh, project and the painting. Okay, yes, it's a, a parallel process of um, painting and printmaking. Uh, in some ways, the printmaking fit ideas to resolve on canvas. In this particular installation, it's called color testing, and color testing not necessarily as a technical work borrowed from a printmaking studio, but uh, it's color testing about layers of color as a metaphor for memories, how we remember things, how we try to grab that very image, and all the accidents and tricks that mind plays in that process of evoking memories. So it's about perception, it's about evoking, and uh, it's in this case it's a um, personal story of a boat. Uh, and the background is a large scale uh, representation of murals. It's all fading colors, it's about lack of maintenance of the buildings in my city, Caracas. It's the tradition of modernity promises a lot of a better future. It's an unfinished project that the modernism didn't reach the institution, the education, but it reached the peak, I would say, in literature and in architecture. But it's how I see, as a, a in retrospective a, a way, a, my city, Caracas, as a, a cities of confrontation of ideas of order and chaos. Okay? It's about contradictions of planification, lack of planification, um, modernism, uh, utopias, uh, nostalgia, I would say. So it's, uh, it's about that, color testing yes. memories. And, I think uh, that uh, there error. is uh, also another aspect to your work that is wonderful, which is uh, the palette and the technique that uh, Cipriano uses in painting is quite extraordinary. He uses just the three uh, main colors of printing, the magenta, the cyan and the yellow. Yeah. And if you look at it, it's all painted in oil, but it's a fairly thin wash of oil that is quite luminous. And I think that when you look at this, uh, I, I hope you won't, won't mind me saying so, Cipriano, but I think you think of so also of Turner and the experiments of that Turner did uh, with uh, this uh, very thin uh, coat of paint. And I must say that uh, it, it's almost as if uh, being in Britain has brought also this uh, This is right, of, uh, I think it's the way, uh, the way I'm painting for this project is uh, I'm trying to mock the process or to imitate the process of, of printing. It's just layer over layer. In these uh, paintings in the background, it's an optical mixture. It's not a physical mixture. So that's why uh, working in printmaking and doing this parallel process is interesting because it changed the procedure. My work is a lot about procedure, about repetition, about schemes of organizing or disorganizing. So it's, uh, you are right when you say it's uh, like a watercolorish uh, approach to the way of painting. Oil yeah. paint. Mm -hmm. yeah. And it's a traditional medium oil painting on canvas. And digital technology could be involved in these uh, ideas of representation of um, the rigidity of modernity. But these um, remembrances of uh, cinetic art with a lot of mistake in the process of printing. It's meant to be straight lines, grid, but there are accidents, which is the constant characteristic of the whole uh, series of work here. It's uh, accidents that in some way can talk about what I was talking previously, that sort of idea of modernity as a possibility of a better future that we never ful fulfill that, that, that dream. Oh, so that's, that's why that sort of um, encounter of lines, um, rigidity and accident in the process of printing.